Hey YouTube, I am a cisgendered Apache helicopter, and we are here for part two of Until Dawn. Now, the first, the part one was kind of a uh, sexual. You know, I almost, I was close to popping a chub, but hopefully this will be more intense. So uh, yeah, let's uh, get into it right where we left off here. This song speaks to me on a spiritual level. year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Sheriff Annie Klein is in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. Listeners, there's an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. Here's Josh, the drunk. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I got to say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood winter getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know God, Sam so sexy. about me, and I know it's going to be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this yeah. one trip we will never forget, all right? Orgy. Yes! Yeah. I'm starting to like Josh now. Josh is alright. And back to this.
This seems like one of those badass openings to one of those shows like Ice Road Truckers. All right, finally some action. What do we got? We got Sam. Memento Mori. All right, yes. The voluptuous Sam. And there's that fucker. Uh, oh, yeah, Sam and his best friend. Diligent, considerate, adventurous. All the traits in a real woman. Hello? Someone there? What kind of breathing is that? Alright, let's walk around. Ooh, ooh. Uh, move the camera here. Ooh. All right, let's grab this. Oh, what? It's busted. Climb up. I'm gonna fucking shake this thing open. All right, we got to come over now. All right, let's uh, hope I don't die here. Ooh. Can't ruin those perfect nails. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Look at this girl, so skilled. To the cabin. Ooh, look at the little squirrel. Huh? Oh yeah, I'm hungry. What the fuck? God damn it. Do I really have to feed this fucker? Come on, here he comes. There we go. Well, that was a waste of food. What if we go starving? All right, dimly lit path. Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, that is not cool. Basically, if you're in one of those totems, you're gonna die. Alright, let's see what we have. Yeah, I get the gist. Let's grab it. <laughs> ah! All right. So maybe someone's not going to die. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, yeah, here's a cable car. All right. Uh, this should be the cable car station. The cell phone, pick it up. Uh, yeah, Snoop. Aha! Look who it is. He knows it. Chris. Let's get the 
shit out of me. Look at this little pig. It's a crush on Ashley. He is methodical, protective, humorous. And look at those glasses, how they just gleam. You scared me. I, I'm sorry, are, are you my secretary? I was buzzing. Cool, well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. Oh, yeah? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. It's gonna blow your mind. I swear, if it's his porn collection, I'm gonna stay. Oh, hey, what is this? What is this? Oh, oh a clue. Nice. You think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Oh, uh, yeah. Someone thought so. Oh, come on. It's Lisa most of the year. Like 1998. Too spooky. Doing at the base of the ski lodge. Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead. Oh, uh, come on, don't be a pussy. All right, here goes. Oh, I'm Chris now. Oh, thanks. Ooh, spooky. Yeah, I get, I get it. Oh, we're supposed to shoot that little baby. All right, part two. Look at this shot. What oh, damn? Whoop. Call me Grizzly Adams, bitch. Wow, nice shoot the tits. Yeah, I'll, I'll be your daddy. So, girl. Mm -hmm. We going to just. Oh well, yeah. Everybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Shut your whore mouth, Sam. Ooh, I don't want to shoot the squirrel. Dead is too mean. Was that? Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Why don't you bring the gun? Bring it. You dumbass. I want it. Damn it. Alright, let's go. Follow that sweet ass. Oh, oh, oh. wanted us to keep it locked keep people out he said that what people i i don't know he, he said they found people sleeping in the station one time it's creepy yeah 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 let the men handle it sam oh, real gentlemen. gentlemen i'm gonna lock you in here Doth thou needs to go anywhere? Here we go. I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. Yes, guess we do. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. I'm not so rich. I only bought a mountain. Yeah, I don't know. That's pretty rich, Sam. Better watch your language. Better talk right. There's nothing on TV these days. Wait. 
I hear music. Oh wait, that's Kevin Car. Well, I'm not done here. Alright, I'm done here. Finally, you coming? Oh, well, I was Give me a few minutes. And get in there, man. Just like going to the prom. Yeah, get up in there. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Oh. Chris may have a crush on Ashley, but still, Sam is smoking hot, and he's been alone with her for like five minutes, maybe even ten. really pumped about it all. Doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's yep. just stop talking about what happened. And enjoy Fucking the friend zoned again. Oh, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. Oh, no way. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Match made. That's how all romance Before stories start. And Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early. And on that day, decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off her training bra. I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Okay, he just laid it on us. I might even a actually end the video right there. Holy shit. God, it's gonna take me a little while to recover from that one. And who do we have here? Jess, Mike's new girlfriend, confident, trusting, irreverent. Yep. I don't even know if I fucking pronounce that right. New people. Time to meet and greet. All right, it's time to go meet some people. She says. <laughs> Holy shit. Jess. Hey. Jessica, over here! Fucking uh, A! Are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Uh, Yeah, fine. Give me a fucking stroke. Oh, God. Oh, oh look at that. God. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look. I got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Ooh, hey, I thought Chris. I was gonna grab that booty. I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts in my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Ooh. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Uh, yeah, let's explain. Mike and M Slick were together. Oh, drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Ooh. Huh. Yes, I would like that back. Need something to masturbate to later. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. Um, what? See who else is coming. That sweet ass better what? follow him. Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam? Baby got <gasps> cakes, and those cakes are gonna expire I mean, out here. Cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Yeah, she gonna, she gonna take these hands. The lodge, like, right where the cable car ends. 
Emily, Mike's ex. Intelligent, resourceful, persuasive, Asian. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Oh, double time, Matt. Emily's new boyfriend. Motivated, ambitious, active, black. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? I'm, I'm your fucking bellboy, I guess, bitch. Carry your own damn bags. What the hell am I doing out here? We're in fucking winter, god damn it. What the hell are you supposed to be getting? Heat stroke? Oh my god. Kill yourself. Kill yourself. You can't put your hands up and smile and think everything's gonna be okay. Mike, Emily's ex. Intelligent, driven, persuasive, dumbass. You guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. I My almost clocked cool. you. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods. It's spooky. Spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Okay, Mike, Mike finna catch these hands. Michael, you gotta step off. Emily and I are together now, and that's just the way it is. Look at those I'm teeth. I'm gonna tell you again. Like, like dentine ice. Well, I thought maybe we could move past all this. We could be buds, but yeah, fine. Mike. No, no, no. No, it's totally cool. I'm just gonna head down the road, be all mature and shit by myself over here. Peace. I think you got the message. Kinda of hot when you get all alpha, you know that? Oh yeah? Well stay away from me because you're fogly as shit. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Of uh, why? I need to go find Sam. No, you don't. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally no, forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Um, yeah, no. Em, I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's yeah, seriously. Out. It's getting dark. You're gonna fucking gangbang fucking Mike. Dark out. I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Why do you have to question oh everything God. I say? I'm sorry, Em. I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly as you can, okay? Um. Okay. Damn it. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. Typical women. Watch this. Mike's probably already got his wiener out. Here we are. We are at the cabin with... I assume this is... Ashley. Has a... Ooh, she has a crush on Chris, too. This is uh, juicy. She's academic. Inquisitive. Forthright. These are very good words. Okay, let's go. Staring into nothingness. All right. You know, ooh, what's 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 down there? Oh, someone sitting on a bench. Oh, ho ho ho. Ooh. Oh, hello. Hello. A I was right. I'm not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. I, w I called that. I called it. Oh! Holy shit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? Anything juicy with that thing? Uh, oh hell yeah! Check it out. Uh yeah yeah, take a look. Um, sure. Uh, go go ahead. 
knock yourself out, I guess. Oh. Uh, bitch. Yeah. Seriously? That's juicy, all right. What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... Damn it. Ha, ha, ha. Matt. No one would ever think of an Asian to cheat.